we're kind of more excited about the power side and, and more complex capital equipment that is, you know, it's not a small uh, commodity product. It's, it takes real engineering know-how. It takes real um, dedicated teams. It takes service professionals to be able to, to, to warranty the product, to keep things up and running. These are 20, 30, as you know, 40-year plants. And we have to be making products that can hopefully live on that long. And, um, you know, in one, one cycle. You know, if you end up having a couple uh, warranty calls and things and you gotta, you gotta put two or three products in a 40, 50 year life, I, I think people will still be okay as long as you get the energy yield, yeah. Are you speeding the energy transition? Here at the Clean Power Hour, our host Tim Montague bring you the best in solar, batteries, and clean technologies every week. Want to go deeper into decarbonization? We do too. We're here to help you understand and command the commercial, residential, and utility solar, wind, and storage industries. So let's get to it. Together we can speed the energy transition. The Clean Power Hour is brought to you by CPS America, maker of North America's number one three-phase string inverter with over eight gigawatts shipped in the U.S., the CPS product lineup includes string inverters ranging from 25 kW to 350 kW. Their flagship inverter, the CPS 350 kW, is designed to work with solar plants ranging from 2 MW to 2 GW. CPS is the world's most bankable inverter brand and is America's number one choice for solar plants. Now offering solutions for commercial, utility, ESS, and balance of system requirements. Go to chintpowersystems.com or call 855-584-7168 to find out more. Today on the Clean Power Hour, we're at RE Boston, and I'm with Brian Wagner, the president of CPS America, and we're going to talk about Chint's global manufacturing capabilities and what's going on in the solar power electronics industry. Welcome to the show again, Brian. Thank you, Tim. Great to be here. Great Appreciate to see you. Appreciate you being here in our CPS uh, booth. Yeah, it's a uh, lot of fun. It's, you become a staple with us, so <laughs> thank you for our, everything you do. Well, thank you. Yeah. I couldn't do it without you, man. Yeah. It's a great partnership. Yeah. So, well, first, let's, let's talk about Boston since we're here. When you come to these shows, I know that sometimes you're rolling out new products, mm -hmm. and sometimes you're just strengthening you know relationships and building new relationships but what's yeah. on your mind and what are you talking to the team about to be top of mind for chint right now well yeah that's i think this time of year i just got back from an overseas trip um and i think this time of year we're we're vetting the different uh facilities that we work with uh the different um product categories that we're entering or thinking about entering um, vetting i should say and so this time of year is really important for really honing in on your strategy, your plan, not getting too wide in your focus and trying to get deep and narrow in what we want to focus on on a, on a show like this. But also uh, this, this show has been tremendous. They've done a great job uh, even now in a bigger facility to kind of set the tone for the year, especially in the Northeast. You're not building as much this time of year with the weather. But you know everybody's here learning about all the technologies, all the all the development partnerships and things that happen and blossom from coming to here. So, yeah, we're excited. I mean, the the new technology and the new segments is kind of what we're here to talk about. I think this is my fourth or fifth RE Northeast, and it's great to just see how year after year it just grows, right? Yeah. And now we're in a bigger space, and there's obviously more people here, and it just you know, slowly but surely, we are growing the energy transition. Yeah. And, you know, we used to say solar is small. I, I wouldn't refer to the solar industry as small anymore. We're a major industry. Yes. We're creating thousands and thousands of jobs. And it's a win-win, right? We're cleaning the grid. We're cleaning the air. We're creating a healthier, safer future for our children and our children's children. Sure. And and so it's a feel good. It's, it's yeah. technology for good. Yeah that we're selling, right? Yeah. So, tell us about your trip. Yeah, so the trip was interesting in, uh, in that, uh, you know, electrification of everything that's happening, data center, all the, all the buzzwords are out there, AI, and, and it's very real. I mean, in fact, one of the talks today, I thought, fascinating, the president of NYSERDA, 
was talking about how the capacity in New York State could double uh, or triple in the next decade for yeah. for load, uh, for demand. So um, that load growth is tremendous for us as an industry. Um, and if you think about what SIA presents and what RE Plus has become, it's it's amazing. I mean, it's probably a decade for us coming to this as CPS, and uh, it's just grown. You couldn't even believe it. So overseas was about making sure we're ready for an event like today and um, to inspire our customers to build more solar, more storage. Um, you know, really that's our main focus, I'd say right now, solar and storage segments. Yeah. Um, so we've launched new products in those categories. I like to, and I think I, I learned this from you, I refer to Chint as kind of the GE of China. Like okay. the, the, the stuff that Chint makes is, is pretty incredible and, and vast, but as it relates to solar, can you tell us what are the products that Chint yeah. makes globally? Yeah, so we, uh, actually GE's been a customer, They one, one's called us the baby GE, so uh, we work with them for many years. And I'd say we're a very diversified global energy company, is how we phrase it now. Um, the, the categories being solar and storage, the breadth of which we're offering products into those two categories now continues to expand. So, for example, um, if you, ahead of a uh, solar project, you could build a substation, right, if there's an upgrade that's needed. We now, as Chint, uh, manufacture high voltage transformers uh, for that category. So, uh, when I was over there touring that f factory and that facility, it's just phenomenal, the breadth and the scope, and um, that's over a $1 billion business for Chint. So, uh, something that we're really excited to be the, the group leading um, you know, leading the future here in the U.S. with that platform. Billion dollar? Yeah, yeah, yeah. over a billion dollar revenue a year. Yeah. And for us in the U.S., obviously that's a, that's a growth this year. Um, we launched last year, it's a growth this year. Um, we also have, as I said, energy storage products. Um, we have a new product called Gonzo that is, um, yeah, it's, we, we think it's one that's gonna fly off the shelves uh, similar to our 350. Our 350 right now has design wins north of 100, even 200 uh, plus megawatt projects. And so that, that product's starting to really take off. Um, you know, we have the 250, 600 volt. With both the 250 and the, and the 350 have the, um, the enhanced safety features, right. meaning make, we want to make safer strings. So the enhanced part about um, creating something that can tech arc inside of the product and from the module side um, is just really innovative. So the 25600 and the 350 both come with this DC enhanced as we call it, which makes safer string projects and in turn, you know, overall should build, you know, more and more solar projects safely. We're excited about that. When you think about a utility solar plant, is there, is there, so substation, transformers, mm -hmm. inverters, the, I mean that's that's yeah. pretty much it, right? So yeah, exactly. So everything related and, to power. And Chint though. does mon manufacture modules. We as CPS don't really get involved too much. They they want us to. We're kind of more excited about the power side and and more complex capital equipment that is, you know, it's not a small uh, commodity product. It's it takes real engineering know-how. It takes real um, dedicated teams. It takes service professionals to be able to, to, to warranty the product, keep things up and running. These are 20, 30, as you know, 40 year plants. And we have to be making products that can hopefully live on that long. And, um, you know, in one, one cycle, you know, if you end up having a couple uh, warranty calls and things and you gotta, you gotta put two or three products in a 40, 50 year life, I, I think people will still be okay as long as you get the energy yield, yeah. So what, are, what other takeaways did you have from your trip to China? Well, so we, um, we also, I would say, have uh, launched a new service brand called CSPS, uh, so Chint Smart Power Services. Uh, so there was strategy as it relates to that. Um, uh, Chint actually has a 20, uh, 20 gigawatt O&M business. So wow. we're not like 
just starting from scratch. We have technology, we have all kinds of things we're going to be offering, and I think it'll be really innovative for our partners. It's all about how do you enable your partners to, to make more profitable solar projects, develop more profitable, live, live on in, um, in the life cycle of the projects, which could be 20, 30, 40 years. And so for us, being able to create services long term for them, I think will be really cool. So you mentioned Gonzo and this new CSPS. Are you are these fully public or do people have yes. to come to Innovation Day to learn more? Yeah, or? yeah, true. I mean, so some of them have been more soft launch. Um, yeah. yeah, some of them have been more soft launch uh, in terms of the, the timing of what, you know, you cannot do everything well at the same time, but you're trying to make everything a priority. So it's more about, you know, how is some famous companies, if you think about how do they launch all these things? Well, you got to have people and you got to invest in your people. You got to, you got to think through the systems of which you bring products through. And sometimes we move things up or back depending on importance. Um, for example, our five megawatt hour battery container did not do that well last year in the market. We're not well known in that space. Sure. So instead we invested in the CNI ESS in Gonzo, bringing that further rather than extending some utility product. We, we know it's good enough and we know it'll have wins this year in the market um, at scale. But we think the CNI product and our segment will be the scalable one first. So it's kind of like that. And then behind that you're, you're chasing say existing projects with our services or future projects that are getting built right now. It's just how fast and how many things can you do at once. Um, that's the challenge, yeah. All right, well, uh, any takeaways from walking the show floor today? Yeah, I'd say we, we have some definitely emerging uh, competitors in storage. And so that has been a very competitive space, I think watching Chint's commitment to energy storage uh, and, and hearing about New York today, uh, Massachusetts, some of their programs. We have a ways to go to make sure we have, you know, something for everyone. Um, you know, I think we're getting there. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Well, um, unless there's anything else you want to talk about, I think we're good. Yeah. No, I, you know, appreciate everybody's uh, Tell our, lis yeah. tell our listeners how they can, uh, what's the best way to connect with you and yeah. learn about Innovation Day? Uh, yeah, good question. So, uh, chintpowersystems.com uh, is our website. Um, you can also send us an email at events at Chint Power. Um, you know, we have a whole team that can help uh, set you up. Uh, yeah, we're planning, last year we probably had over 300 people. This year's probably closer to 500, we're hoping. So, it's starting to really build. and. You know, we're excited you're coming. Yeah, I've had so many conversations, Brian, just today wow. with engineers and EPCs who I met last year yeah. at Innovation yeah. Day, and they're yeah. like, that event is my favorite event. Yeah. And so it is on par with any other conference that you may have attended, just know that. Yeah. And reach out to me on LinkedIn if you want to learn about Innovation Day. Obviously, you can find Chint at Chint Power Systems. I'm Tim Montague. Check out all of our content at cleanpowerhour.com. Please give us a rating and a review on Apple or Spotify. And let's grow solar and storage. The Clean Power Hour is brought to you by CPS America, maker of North America's number one three-phase string inverter with over eight gigawatts shipped in the U.S. The CPS product lineup includes string inverters ranging from 25 kW to 350 kW. Their flagship inverter, the CPS 350 kW, is designed to work with solar plants ranging from 2 megawatts to 2 gigawatts. CPS is the world's most bankable inverter brand and is America's number one choice for solar plants. Now offering solutions for commercial, utility, ESS, and balance of system requirements. Go to chintpowersystems.com or call 855-584-584. 7168 to find out more.